Hi, in this short video uh, I'll present a new feature of the uh, Piezo LabVIEW program which allows users to choose an arbitrary position on the range of motion of this Piezo. So let me just turn off the program, start the program again. Here it asks me to choose a configuration file. Now the program initializes with these numbers because this is what I chose uh, when I configured the application and I want to draw your attention on the indicator for the position so this bar represents the entire range of motion of the piezo this is what is possible for the piezo to do uh, I just put the calibration factor here 1 which um, means that the position bar gives me the range in voltage. We know that the piezo tubes are uh, driven by the two axis piezo driver is um, operating on a range of 3.8 volts. So this is what we have here. So let's say we want to move a total distance of 0 0.1. We choose this to be a relative position and as we press the move button it consumes consecutively moves along uh, this range. I can choose to go to an absolute position, let's say minus 0 0.5. There we go. And what's interesting here is that we could I'll just move a little bit more to the uh, oops, uh, all the relative motion Okay, and if we activate these these controls here, I can make this the zero position. These are the voltage limits of the DAC card that we're using. So we're using a DAC card that has only positive alt, uh, volts out. Uh, these voltage limits can be chosen for your specific DAC card. And now let's say press this button here, and uh, what happened is that um, the position where I was at became the new zero position. So now it gives me the uh, uh, a different scale for the range of motion. So we can start again to move in the in relative uh, motion. Let's say we move one at a time. One, two, three. And now we can call this position zero. Notice that there is um, the, the range here of motion doesn't change. It still sits at uh, 3.8 volts because we have the calibration factor equal to 1. So this just shows you how that um, you can choose any uh, position on the motion of range as your origin of motion. Um, so basically you can take advantage of the entire uh, range. Thank you very much.